Hi, this is Dr. Jansen, and uh, about a year ago, I think, we filmed an osteoporosis exercise video, and then subsequently I'm seeing patients once a year or every six months, and I'm finding out now that pretty much nobody did the exercises, and if people did them, they did them for a week or two, and then they gave up. So I think the problem with the exercises was they were boring. I didn't make them up. I actually copied them from a 40-year research project called Strong Women Stay Young. And I guess they must have made those people do those exercises, and then it worked. So let's just move on. I have to find a way to uh, get you to do these exercises, but make it fun. And also uh, to make sure you understand why you're doing it, because certainly I'm going to have uh, patients following directions better if they understand why they're doing it. So let's talk about that really briefly. Why are you doing exercises if you have osteoporosis? And the answer is that if you t take a bone, um, this is wood, but let's say it's a bone, and you put a deforming pressure on the bone, which is the same as a muscle pulling on a bone, then there will be a negative electrical charge that forms at the point of the most deformity. And the negative electrical charge will cause bone cells to grow. And those cells are called osteoblasts. And they will proliferate or increase in their number when there is a negative charge on the bone. And like I said, the negative charge is caused by muscles contract and pull on the bone and create that force. So that's why they say you need to do weight-bearing exercises because you need to use your muscles. So let's say you're taking calcium supplements, you're taking magnesium, you're taking zinc, the doctor twice a year is giving you a prolia shot. You're taking, you know, reclass, whatever you're taking. You know, it's not going to work. None of those things will work without the negative charge. The, the cells will not proliferate without the negative charge. So that's why hand in hand, 50% of uh, improving osteoporosis is on your shoulders. You. You must do weight-bearing exercises where you have a significant pull on the bone. So I had made exercises with dumbbells like this, and I don't think dumbbells are very attractive to women in particular, and men too. They're just kind of boring. They're heavy, and where are you going to store them? You know, um, so... Uh, so this kind of exercise didn't work. So let's go on from here. So what I'm going to suggest to you today in this video is that you get yourself some kind of a weight system like these uh, weights that I bought. And these are weights that you can wear. Uh, this is a, a fitness weight set with um, ankle, I'm, I'm sorry, wrist, hand, a handheld thing, and an ankle thing. And I bought this in Aldi store for $20, so very inexpensive. Um, this, is the, this is the hand piece, so it's easy to put it on. Like this, you put your fingers in there, put your thumb in there, and then there's Velcro. So it's really easy to put it on. Okay, and then this is the, this is the ankle one. This goes around your ankle. And these are not heavy. These are only about a pound. So, but I think that's a good idea to start out, you know, with just a pound. And then I also bought this weighted vest. It's a 12-pound weighted vest. And I also bought this in Aldi, and this was $20. So this whole setup cost me 40 bucks. So it was really good. And I plan on using this myself. You know, whatever I tell you guys to do, I'm pr probably doing it myself. So... This is really heavy. This is 12 pounds. So um, I'm going to show you some exercises wearing all this stuff. You know, so you get, and, and this is easy to store, unlike the dumbbells, you know, because it's light and it's flexible. So uh, let's, let's do, let's have some fun. Let's do something fun or something that you have to do anyways.
So I did all that in like 10 minutes and I'm really tired and I'm sweating. So why don't we just pick that as the time goal twice a week, just do 10 minutes, you know, put this stuff on and go for a walk. You know, like I was showing you how I was power walking, you know, or just put it on and do your vacuuming. That'll take you about 10, 15 minutes maybe. You know, put these on when you vacuum. And then maybe, I really like this vest, you know. And, and I know when you take these things off, it's, uh, you can feel the pressure coming off your body, you know. So you actually get a, a really good workout with these things. So good luck with this. And I'm going to be, you know, monitoring this. And see, let's see how this works. This is the osteoporosis uh, exercises 2.0. And, uh, you know, this is what medicine is. You, you know, you learn. We're learning as we go. So let's try this. And I want to see better bone density uh, results on you guys. All right. Good luck with this and keep in touch.